Okay, hi everyone. So this video is going to be a full album collection update. So I originally didn't really have any plans to film this video this year just because it's a lot of work to make and also I just recently got a lot more busy because work started and there's just a whole bunch of different things but I actually ended up asking on my community tab if you guys would be interested in a full collection update and it was an overwhelming majority saying that I should film this video so I decided that I would. Luckily I have some time to get through it so yeah but um, I'm not promising that this video will be filmed all in one day. There will probably be several lighting changes and things like that. Uh, I have a lot of stuff to go through so I can only imagine it'll take some time. But with that said I will go ahead and get started. I'm going to go through by artist but I'm also just going to go through the in the order that things are on my shelf. Um, there's no real rhyme or reason as to why I'm going through the things in a particular order. It's just the way they are on my shelf. So it will be kind of random. So uh, with that said, I will start and I'm just going to go through and say each album. I'm not really going to say much. I'll start off with Hot Shot. So we have their first single album, Take a Shot, and Hot Shot are my alt group. So that's why they're first on my shelf. So then this is uh, their first mini album and my Hot Shot. And I have their first mini album. This is the repackage. I'm a Hot Shot. And then I have their Time to Fly High special edition album. And I have their second mini album, Early Flowering. And then Hot Shot Solos, I have Tehan's birthday album. And I also have a signed promo. And I have Simon's My Moment, this is actually a signed promo. And then I just have a normal copy of the other version. And then I also have a signed copy of Simon's Blue album. And then we can move on to Uptension, they're my second alt group. So we have their first mini album, Top Secret. Their second mini album, Bravo. Their third mini album, Spotlight. This is the gold version. And then we have the silver version. And I have a signed copy of their fourth mini album, Summer Go. And this is the limited edition of Summer Go. And then we have Burst, their fifth mini album. And we have sixth mini album, Stardom. And their first full album, Invitation. Uh, I think this is the silver version, but I'm not sure. And I believe this is the red version of that album. Then we have their seventh mini album, Labyrintho. This is the crime version. And this is the clue version. Then we have their eighth mini album, Moment of Illusion. So this is the illusion version. And then the moment version, this is signed. And then I have their 2017 special photo edition album with Going Crazy. And their 2018 special photo edition, this is signed by all members. And that is it for full group pre and stuff for obtention. So then next I just have Jin Yuk's solo. And this is the other version. I don't know what the versions are, but I have both. I don't really plan to buy his solo stuff in the future though. And then I have Japanese stuff. So I have their first single ID. That's the limited edition. And then I have a few copies of just the other versions. So this is, I think, Normal A. I have Wusuk's member and then two of Zhao's member versions. So yes. Then I have the limited edition of Wild Love and I have Zhao and Huani for the member covers. And then I just have their third single Chaser. So this is the limited edition and that is all for obtention. So next is Impact and I just have their first single Lollipop. This is a signed copy and I have another signed copy. This is not a promo version though. And I have their second album Revolt and their third single Only You and then their first mini album. And I have a few Japanese things for them as well. So this is just their uh, Japanese version of their second single, Revolt. And then I have the Tension Up Japanese release. And then next we have We In The Zone. So I have their first mini album, self-titled. And I also have a signed copy. And then I have their second mini album. And then I have the Japanese version of their second mini album. So then next is New East. I'll do New East W first. So I just have W here, uh, both versions. This one is signed by Beko. And I have Who You, both versions. And then I have their Waken album. And then for just New East, I have their first single album, Face, first mini album, Action, second mini album, Hello, third mini album, Sleep Talking, their first album, Rebirth, their fourth mini album, Q Is, and then their fifth mini album, Canvas. And then I also have their Happily Ever After album. So I have all versions. This one is signed by Beko, but I have all four versions. And then I also have all three versions of the table. Um, I don't have all versions of their newest album yet. I plan on getting it eventually though. So then next is kind of like one-on-one -on -one solos and stuff. First, I just have both versions of Jisung's first mini album aside. And then his... Dear Diary album, I have that as well. Then I have the 9801 album, and I have Jihoon's A Clock, his first mini album, and I have a second mini album too, 360. I just have one version. And I have Jin Young's solo single, and I have both versions of Jaehwan's first mini album. One of them is signed. And then I have Daniel's debut album, Color On Me. And then I have his first mini album, Cyan. Then I have Sungwoo's uh, first mini album, Layers. And then CIX, so this is their first mini album, Hello Stranger. And then I just have their second mini album, Hello Strange Place. 
Uh, I just collect one version per album, so far at least. And then we have AB6, so I have their first mini album. This is the S version, I version, and the X version. And then I have their first album, Sixth Sense, uh, both versions. And then I have one Wii, so the first thing I have is their like debut Japanese single, Reminisce About All. And then I have their first full-length album. It's a little big to fit in frame, but this is one. And then I have uh, H&D's mini album, Soulmate. All right, and then next we have 101. So I have this, um, the Japanese version of To Be One. And this is actually the Taiwanese version of To Be One. And then I have To Be One, this is signed by Minhyun. And this other version signed by Jisung. And then I have Nothing Without You. This is the Wanna version. And then the one version of Nothing Without You. And I have I Promise You. This is the day version. Then I have the night version. And I have all six versions of Undivided. So this is like the group version and the triple position version, I think. Yeah. And the Lean On Me version and the heel version and the number one version and the art book version. And then I just have Power of Destiny. And I don't know which version is which. I think that's the adventure version. And I think this is, well, I don't remember what this version is called. All right, and then next is NCT. So I'll do 127 first, but I just have their first mini album. And I have Limitless. I only have one version out of the three, I think there is. And Cherry Bomb. And then I have both versions of Regular Irregular. So I think that's the Irregular version, and this is the Regular version. And then I have Regulate. I have Taeyong's cover. I also have Yuta's cover, and then I have We Are Superhuman, and then I have Neo Zone, both versions. This is the NNC version. Then I also have the T version, and then I also have the repackage, the final round. I actually have four copies. I have this is two of the like Korean version, and then here's two of like the American version. I have no reason to keep them all, but and then I also have the Kino of Neo Zone, and then for Japanese stuff for 127, I have their first mini album, this is Taeyong's version, and I also have Yuta's version, and I also have Taeyong's version of their full album, Awaken. So that's everything I have for 127. Okay, then I'll do Dream next. So first is their first single, The First, then their first mini album, We Young, their second mini album, We Go Up, and then I have both versions of their third mini album, We Boom, and both versions of their fourth mini album, Reload. And then I also have uh, Jano's version of The Dream, which was a Japanese release. So then I'll do Wavy next. So for them, I have their first mini album, Take Off, second mini album, Take Over the Moon, and I also have the sequel version. And then I have their first full length album, Awaken the World, and I have both versions. To finish out my NCT collection, I have NCT 2018's Empathy album, both versions. I do consider my Super M collection part of my NCT collection because I only collect NCT members, but for that, I have the group version, Taeyong's version, Ten's version, Mark's version, and Lucas's version. So that is everything for my NCT collection. Okay, next I'll go through my JVJ collection. So I first have their limited edition of their first mini album, and I have both versions of Fantasy. This one is actually the version that came in the limited edition. And I have their True Colors album, this one signed by Taehyun, and I have both versions of it unsigned. And I have New Moon. And keeping up with the JVJ theme, I have Dong Han's first mini album, D-Day, and this is both versions. And I have his second mini album, D-Night, both versions of course. And then both versions of his third mini album, D Hours, and this one is signed. Then moving on to JVJ 95, I have both of their versions for their first mini album, Home, both versions of their second mini album, Awake, and both versions of their third mini album, Spark, this one signed. And moving on to 100%, I have their Better Day album, I'm not sure where it is in their discography, and I have their Sketchbook mini album, and Sunshine, and I have both versions of their most recent release, Retro. So next we'll move on to some bro groups. So first we'll do CLC, so I have their first mini album, First Love, their second mini album, question, their third mini album Refresh, their fourth mini album Nuclear, their fifth mini album Crystal, sixth mini album Freezem, seventh mini album Black Dress, and eighth mini album No One. Now we'll do Brave Girls, so I have their first single, The Difference, their first mini album Back to the Future, their second mini album Reissue, uh, this is a digital single, this is a promo, but it's for you, and it includes only here and in Yujin. And I have a signed copy of Deepened, and then I have High Heels, and then a promo copy of their Yuhu digital single. And then I have Roland, their fourth mini album. This is an unsigned copy. I also have a signed copy. And I have a promo of the new version of Roland. So, so then we'll do Daya. So I have their first album, Do It Amazing. Finally, this is like holy grail item for me. Then I have their happy ending album. Then I have one version of Spell. This is a limited edition. Then I have both versions of YOLO. Then I have Love Generation. So I have a signed copy of the like group version. Then I have both of the like unit versions. And then I have the limited edition. And I have all three versions of present. So there's one, two, and three. 
Then I have Summer Aid, their fourth mini album, their fifth mini album, Neutro, and their sixth mini album, Flower for Seasons. All right, next I have Eyes One. So I have both versions of their Colorize album. And I have Hard Eyes, so this is the Violetta version. I have Taewon's cover, and I have a signed copy of Chaeyoung. They have all three versions of Blue Eyes, so I have the I Was version, the I Am version, and the I Will version. And I have their newest album. I'm, I'm guessing it's pronounced One York Diary. I don't know, but I have Sakura's cover for the diary version, Sakura's cover for that other version, and then I have the 3D version as well. And then for Japanese releases for them, I just have their uh, debut. And we have Red Velvet, so I have their first mini album, Ice Cream Cake, and I have the Red, and I have The Velvet, and Russian Roulette, and Joy's version of Rookie, and The Red Summer. Then I have Perfect Velvet, and... Summer Magic, Joy's version, and RBB, uh, Joy's cover of the Rova Festival Day 1, Rova Festival Day 2, and Rova Festival the finale. Okay, next we can move on to my Twice collection. So I have uh, The Story Begins, page 2, this is the pink version, and I also have the mint version. And then we have Twice Coaster Lane 1, I think this is the magenta version, and this is the apricot version. We have Twice Coaster Lane two and I have both versions of that. And then next to Signal, so I have the A version and the B version. And we have Twice Duram, so I just have one version of this. And then I have Mary and Happy. And then I have both versions of What is Love, all three versions of Summer Nights. Um, we have all three versions of Yes or Yes. That one and that one. We have all three versions of Fancy You. And I have all three versions of Feel Special, so A, B, and C. And then lastly for twice, I have all three versions of more and more. So again, A, B, and C version. All right, next we have Itzy. So I have both versions of It's Icy. And then I have all three versions of It's Me. Okay, next we have IOI. So I just have the uh, limited version of Chrysalis and also the normal version. And I have a signed copy of What a Man and then Miss Me. And for Unity, I have their first mini album line and then their second mini album begin with the end. Then for Enchia, I have her second mini album, Some. And next is Pentagon. So I just have their first mini album, Pentagon. Their second mini album, Five Senses. Their third mini album, Ceremony. Their sixth mini album, Positive. Their seventh mini album, Thumbs Up. Uh, their eighth mini album, Genius. And then their ninth mini album, Summer. Pentagon is one of the few groups that I don't get every single one of their albums, but Mostly just the ones I really like. So next we have U and B. So I have their first mini album, Boyhood, and also the limited edition. Then I have both versions of their Black Heart album, and I have this one signed. Then next we have Big Star. We just have their first mini album, I think. Probably first single album is their debut. It's Big Start. Their second mini album, Hang Out, and their third mini album, Shine and Moonlight. They have Eden. He was in U and B and Big Flow. This is his solo album. And then I have both versions of X One's album. This one is signed by Hangyo. So we're on the last shelf now. Uh, this shelf just consists of groups I have albums for but don't really collect. And also they're not in any particular order. So things may be out of order here. So first we start with Kristen V's Like a V. And we have Triple H's 1990 X. We have Samuel's One. Uh, his first mini album, 16, and his first album, I Can. So then we have MXM. I have both versions of their matchup album, then both versions of their More Than Ever album. I have Chunga's Gotta Go single, Hyunga Kinshihan's Da 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 album, MVP's Manifest, FX's Four Walls, and this has Amber on the back. Then we have Luna's first solo album, Free Somebody. So then I have WJSN, so I have their second mini album, The Secret, and their third mini album from WJSN. Then I have Girl Kind's second single album, Sorry, uh, 17's 17 Carat, and I have MXM's Unmixed, and I have both versions of that. So then I have Reigns' first mini album, Sunshine, and I have both versions of Priston's second mini album, School Out, and also both versions of their first mini album, Hi Priston. I have FX's Red Light album, Junghyun's first full album, She Is, and then I have his Poet Artist album as well, and then I have Kim Lip's single, and I have uh, Eve's single as well, and then I have ONF's first mini album, uh, the CD is not in there, but and then I have Oh My Girl's Wendy Day. So with that said, uh, that was actually everything for my album collection. There's one thing I don't think I showed, and that is my Girl Kind album for their most recent single, Future. And I didn't show it because it has my last name written on it, and I don't really feel like doing the editing to make it so you can't see it. So I'll probably just put a picture here so you can see it. Um, but yeah, so that was everything. I'll put the total of albums I have on the screen right now so you can see how many that I have. Like I said, that was my entire album collection 
for the year of 2020. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video.